functions were controlled. His wife was dying along with him because she was trying to keep him alive. And now he's walking around half an hour, an hour a day, and he said, I only stop because I get bored. And everybody looked at him. Wasn't he the guy that was, yeah, he's a, he's a walking testimony, they say. And this is the very process. It's the blood. Okay. Well, is there any other thoughts you guys want to share you know here? I was thinking, I was saying, um, probably if we had known about that machine before, because hey. years ago, they amputated her big toe, her left big toe, mm -hmm. right there in Houston. Um, yeah. He, she had to come. Remember, she came. She to came up to Houston to stop some infection. She had no. She don't have no big toe. So she this, this big toe. Right? The next foot. The next foot. So maybe you know from that time, maybe they could have saved that toe. Too. That big toe. Yes. Yeah, that in itself demonstrates the protocol that is in place today and that was just a big toe you know which would have been an ease to, to take care of and here it was up they were going to amputate three inches below the knee yeah and that's how much further it went and all of that area was dead um well i thank you for those description that certainly helps again and again we have uh dora dyer sister of doreen from belize and lucy um, I gotta remember your last name now. I keep thinking Charlie. Who's the Charlie? Okay. <laughs> um, and she's also Doreen's sister. She's the one that was in charge of coordinating all the um, the scheduling for her sister Doreen, as you've heard. So I thank you, Lucy, and appreciate your sharing that with us. A lot of people will appreciate you sharing those details that they can understand more what happened thanks again and over here we have miss miss sylvia actually sylvia is my auntie she is one of the um i i think the brains of belize really? i really appreciate um they can't get her or she can't stay out of being retired she's so needed <laughs> But um, I'm so appreciative of you guys coming here and being able to share this with you. And thank you so much for um, the idea of having a little satellite um, there for what we're doing. And I will certainly support you guys as much as I can. And as we get going, I will come by. Okay. Well, I, I will definitely plan we and thank come. Thank you so much also for the interest you have taken in us. Oh, that can't go away. Well, you, are, you. you must remember too, you know. Remember your name, Cadbury, uh, Belize, <laughs> so that's where you must go back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as you mentioned that, um, well, I'm going to take this off the line, but my mom said, I beat the nurse. I, I was born before the midwife got there. They, they sent for the midwife, and I came out before <coughs> the midwife, so she was sitting there with the baby in her hand. Quick. Yeah. Uh -huh. And I was on, in Belize, Fort Street, or something like that, where they lived. Well, so when the yeah. wife reached, you done over yeah. <laughs> So, yes, I remember being in Belize. I will go back. <laughs> okay? Yes. Thank you, guys. Yes. I love you and appreciate your visiting us with that. Same here. Thank you. Right. God bless.